about nothing. Not today, actually. Uh, today's just another one of those. Uh, I want to sit down and make. I want to paint some some stuff, and as the day goes along, I, I will continue to co uh, talk and I will continue to show you what I'm doing, and the re and I'll tell you the reasons why I'm uh, painting these things in particularly uh, versus why I would paint something else, uh, if that makes any sense. So. Um, if I can turn this camera around, and then if I can do it like this. Now, in this video, or live stream, well, in this video, I will uh, be painting a few things. Uh, honestly, one thing that I'll be painting uh, is a uh, mud jug of sorts. Uh, it's just an old mud jug that I've had, and I want to paint it. Like, I want to have pictures on it and stuff that represent, like, my uh, friends and stuff. I don't know how to... I wish that I knew how to, like, have this in a way to where y'all could see me as well. If that would make, if that makes any sense, uh, instead of just the paintings. I, I do wonder if I could get it up higher. Actually, I got an idea, which, uh, will probably be better, at least for the video. Oh, yeah, that, that's a lot better, at least for the, as long as this stuff don't fall. All right, all right. So, today, uh... Other than my tripod being in the way. So this right here will mainly stay right here. Because I, I, I have a few things I just want to paint today. And uh, first I'm going to add a little couple layers to this. Because I want to paint this black first. And I want to uh, do this as a little trophy to my friend. Uh, uh, Y'all seen them on uh, low key. Uh, and on my channel before. Uh, just something uh, that because he's stuck around, been cool all uh, this time. Friends and family, I love uh, probably the most in my opinion, because friends and family, friends come and go, but uh, some of them stick, and those ones that stick are always the best, because you just never know uh, what kind of stuff could happen every day, or this or that. Yeah, uh, every day there's friends that will come, there will be friends that will go, but uh, the friends that stick most of the time uh, are the ones that uh, Friends that stick most of the time are the ones that will actually be there at your wedding day or be there on the day that you really, really need them uh, for whatever reason it might be. So I, I was just uh, checking out, seeing if uh, there was any anything on this uh, thing that shouldn't be there or anything. Now this, this hat right here, I've already kind of uh, did what I was going to do uh, to put the logo or whatever kind of logo I wanted to do to it on here. This, uh, I was, so this is how, how I did this uh, right here. I got me a. Oh no! I got me a glue stick, uh, like a hot glue stick. Uh, that's pretty much all I did with this. You can pick these up at any Dollar General or Arts and Crafts area from Walmart or something, or any store that you know that sells Arts and Crafts stuff. Pretty much. And uh, what I did was I took. I use this lighter, for example, this torch. Uh, I took the torch. I I. I started melting it and I just kind of let it drip onto it and then I, I kind of like smeared it in really good where I, at first I had a circle on this and I did not like the circle at uh, actually the first time that I don't like the circle it looks good and it was all smoothed out and everything so what I did was uh, while it was on there I took a tor the torch and just kind of like melted it and then uh, again on there that's why that bl <laughs> black spots in the middle uh, because uh, I kind of burnt the hat a little bit that's underneath that uh, you can't, you luckily can't tell, uh, underneath it, and that's the good part. So, uh, that, my plan is, since this is like a, uh, plastic on there, I'm gonna paint on to this, uh, I don't really know what I would put on here is the thing, because this hat itself is just a tan color, so I wouldn't know what, I honestly, to put on there, but I'm gonna think of some stuff, uh, as I'm painting this, uh, these other things, and, uh, my own ideas of whatever the heck I might do. Like, right here. I have a pair of sunglasses. I love sunglasses in particularly because they can fold. And if I want, uh, like, if I'm needing to take them off or something, I can just fold them up, put them in my pocket, whatever. And uh, there they are. Also, they fit my face better. It feels like at least because it is more like it kind of rounds out out on the nose, really. So, and I got a big old head, honestly. The, the downside to these sunglasses right here, these types that fold and stuff. Or if you do have uh, long hair and stuff, uh, because this stuff right here opens and shuts all the time, uh, I don't really, I don't know if you can see it too good, but uh, 
it opens and shuts, and then uh, that pinches the heck out of either your skin or uh, your hair, whatever it is. Uh, especially this part right here, uh, if you got like a unibrow or something, I feel like that would hurt the unibrow a lot because uh, it has all this stuff right here on the inside. But honestly, if I'm being honest, these are probably one of uh, probably my number two pairs of sunglasses. The pair, my favorite pair, are honestly these that I have on my face uh, that I just took off to show you. Main reason is because it doesn't make things too dark. I like I like sunglasses just in general. I have a bunch of pair. I, I have a few. Uh, I have this bright pair right here. Uh, I just like wearing sunglasses a lot of times, uh, even uh, indoors a lot of times because these are not dark. That's why I like these a lot. Uh, these are not too dark when I even wear them inside the house. And uh, it's not that I'm, oh, you're a weirdo, you wear sunglasses in the house. It's like mainly when I'm focusing on a video game or focusing on a, a screen too much, these are not that dark. Uh, I used to have a, a pair of yellow pair that would make uh, everything kind of yellow tinted. But uh, those honestly broke and I, I do not know... I can't find a good pair that will fit my face again, and uh, these fit my face really good. And the only thing is, these fit my face even better than these. Uh, and I bought these at like Bargain Hunter or some shit. I don't even know uh, where I bought them from. But uh, and also you can tell the size difference of like the squareness uh, is on these are bigger than these. Uh, I, I don't. Only part uh, problem I have with these types of sunglasses is because of what it's uh, this little prong right here. This part right here tends to like weaken very, very easy. Uh, it's it's very simple to just open and shut now. Uh, these fold easy, yeah, but like I still have to do some pushing to close them. Uh, and like I show it on these because uh, honestly, uh, these are uh, like they don't shut easy. They're not worn out. They're not worn down. Mainly because uh, it's kind of like built into it. If that makes any sense, uh, they're the plastic and everything is part of it, and then it has that screw, one screw, really. There, there's a bunch of different types of sunglasses, a bunch of blah, 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 this and that. But uh, this, these are probably my uh, number one pair right now because they feel the best on my face. They don't hurt my eyes or my nose. They don't make me want to take them off, honestly. And also, they're very nice looking. They look kind of like made of wood. <laughs> I don't uh, really know. What I want to do, honestly, is look up something on tomorrow's episode all right so this hat uh, is just pretty much good vibes uh, uh to do for this hat so all right so i'm not exactly how i want to do this they're literally jackhammering outside my office today i apologize that the sound in this episode is fresh and taste. all right so i do know i have a picture of what i'm trying to draw i think i do at least okay so this this is pretty much what i want to draw purple uh, on this and then uh, it'll be yellow uh, thing itself honestly with the paint the way it's going right now i need to let it dry so i can put another layer here in a minute on there once it fully dries i can i can do what i want to do more to it all right so that mud jug i can't really do nothing with it and uh, why the fuck does this keep doing shit i think i think it just really wants to show my me off <laughs> i got something that I want to do with these, honestly. These, uh, these just nothing too fancy, honestly. Uh. And I saw it eat it. Eat it, Sorry, I'm very thirsty.
Nah, no, I mainly just put noob on these, dude. I just like to show off what I'm doing, just in case, like, oh, if this could inspire somebody else to want to make something of their own. And also, I like to make stuff for my friends and my family and everybody, and I'm able to show somebody something. I know that's backwards, I think, at least in this video. It'll be right side, right way, and when you're looking at it. Then I'm going to do it on this side, too, but I'm going to let this side dry first. Try to probably put another layer of purple on this. Honestly, that's not what I'm trying to keep it as at all. The bad part about painting, though, is if uh, you are a lot of the time, especially with this type of paint, at least, because it's acrylic, it, yes, it does dry pretty quick. But at the same time, it, it's adding layers and stuff. You ha it's a lot more consistent of having to add layers, and it takes longer than you would want it to to dry, so you can keep adding more uh, stuff to it. Can't seem to gain any growth after two years of hard work. Hard work and patience are really what's required to find success in any field in life. Two years is a very small amount of time. And you gotta be prepared to commit everything if you want to succeed. To me, creativity is the ability to be able to believe in the way in which you see the world so much that you actually create an art form out of it. And from what I understand, it's like video is, a, is an outlet, it's a voice. Poems are an outlet, music may be an outlet. It's, it's a personal perception of the world and the creation around that that becomes interesting. You just got to keep at it. There's so many different ways of finding execution and people that will find your work and platforms. But if you just keep and stay true to yourself and the way in which you see things, and that's your, what your videos are about. That's interesting. That's unique. That's very beautiful. And this is uh, this side too. So right here, I'm kind of sharpening, like, well, getting this. But, uh, but it's mainly because uh, I have a little tiny spot that I want to get out. I wanted that like a thinner. Now, I, I guess I'm done with these sunglasses. I don't really know what else I want to do with them. I, uh, I just wanted them as that way. But uh, this, I don't know what to do because it's uh, taking forever to dry that purple. It's scary and it's scary for me, but I'm not afraid of change and I'm not afraid to change. See, being original isn't about being first, it's about being different and about being better. Eventually this will dry and I don't know when. I'm painting a white circle around this so that the blue would pop out and then I'm going to add the black stuff later. I probably won't get it all in the, into this video, honestly. I'll probably have to wait till most of this stuff dries and then be able to continue this video maybe later this week or next week or some something. Who knows? I might end up not finishing on camera at all. Tend to be how I do things because uh, I tend to not finish or I'm, I'll look like I'm finished or something and then I go back and fix it off camera. It's not that I don't want people to see it. It's just that after it finally dried, I went back and did some stuff to it without cutting the camera back on. I have a bad tendency to do stuff like that because I just don't, uh, it's more like I don't, uh, once I get everything taken down, like the camera and all the setup and everything cleaned up, I just might leave out like the one color that I know I, that's going to be needed to fix or something, which I shouldn't do that at all, especially for if I want to put it into a video. This one's going to be for this uh, logo. This one's going to be for the LK logo uh, because, uh, or vice versa. One of the two is going to be for the other. Probably since this one's bigger, it's going to be for us, the, the logo that I'm right here. 